if anyone does want to get into comics, man, there are so many good places to start these days, though. And I would always want to turn people towards trying. I know a lot of people will see these huge like undertakings of, of comics, but there's a lot of one-offs that are just wonderful. The comics that got me into it, and they're just one-offs, The Pro, which is a hilarious, hilarious comic book about mm-hmm. a prostitute who becomes a superhero. And it's just a single, single trade. And it's so good. And then you've got We Three. We Three is about like three house pets that got lost or something. And then the government took them to their testing facilities and like fixated like robot bodies on these like just normalized house pets. And so they just gave these house pets these like killing machines. Um, and it sounds funny. Like you want to kind of laugh because you're like, oh, this is going to be goofy. No, it is serious as a heart attack. This is a dramatic. The uh, prostitute that becomes the superhero is the funny one. Oh, that's the funny one. (laughs) And then this one is the serious one about the. This one's very serious. (laughs) And and then Pride of Baghdad. That was another one off that just the artwork is just stunning. It's based off of a true story of a bomb that fell in Baghdad during the war and it exploded by the zoo and obviously a lot of the animals died but a lot of them were set free in Baghdad including a pride of lions and this kind of side story follows these lions as they're kind of walking through a war zone and just discovering this whole new world that they never knew existed outside the walls of this zoo these are great single one-off comics that people can pick up and read in a day and just feel good that they love it, that it's gorgeous and that they've helped the industry a little bit. And it's easy to get into because you don't have to remember all of these crazy facts and, and all these characters. It's just these single stories.